Yo, Yankees fans, how's it going? It is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, hola, como estas? Yankees fans, as we all know by now, Harper and Machado prefer to play in the Bronx. They're not big fans of playing in Philadelphia. Can you blame them? Hey, nothing against people from Philly, but nothing like New York. And this also suggests that other teams like the White Sox and the Dodgers haven't really offered contracts that are blowing Manny and Harper out of the water. Obviously, if they're talking about Philly, Philly is the one that is offering the most money. So, Harper and Machado's camp has made it blatantly obvious that they want to play for the Yankees. The only way the Yankees could possibly sign both of these players if the Yankees find a way to move Ellsbury, who is owed $47 million, and John Carlos Stanton's contract. People are people rage when they hear John Carlos Stanton's name, but it's common sense. Specifically, the Dodgers are looking for a right-handed bat, a power bat. Obviously, if Harper and his camp are putting out that they want to play for New York, obviously the Dodgers haven't, or any other team except the Phillies, have offered Harper a contract that is blowing him out the water. The only way you take on a Harper and Machado is if you sacrifice one of your homegrown players. People forget. They're over here saying, oh my God, you want to trade Stanton? But hey, um, sign Machado and Harper. Are you guys serious? There's a whole bunch of players on the New York Yankees that are going to become free agents. The Yankees are going to need to pay these guys. And the only way you take on a Machado or Harper, both, is if you say, hey, I don't want to pay Gary Sanchez when he becomes a free agent. Hey, I don't want to pay Aaron Judge when he becomes a free agent. But the Yankees are pretty stupid if they don't offer Judge the moon. He's a keeper. Okay? So that's the only way that the Yankees could take on a Harper or Machado. If they don't do it like that, if they sign only a Machado, they still need to move an Ellsbury or get ready, get ready to get mad, a Stanton. Period. It's common sense, folks. It's not me hating on a certain player. It's what the Yankees are doing. It's how they're set up. You got to think into the future. They got a mega contract, and if they want to add more, they need to move a mega contract. So if they move a big contract, let's say like a Stanton, that means that they still need to sacrifice a player that's homegrown. If you want to sign both Manny and Harper. It's like Thanos from Avengers. He gets the Soul Stone. He sacrifices his daughter. This is what the Yankees and Cashman are going to have to do if, if they go after Harper or Machado. So Yankees fans, leave your opinions in the comment section below. What do you guys think? Do you think it's possible that the Yankees add Manny and Harper? If so, how are the Yankees going to accomplish this? Leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from m1news.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you out next time.